These two assholes started a fight with me. What? Where? A bar. I was with friends, but they left. Were you drinking? It's a bar. I wasn't drunk. But could you have just left? I was leaving. They were drunk. One of them put their hands on me. That was your only option? There wasn't a bouncer or the bartender? No, Mom. It happened fast. Was the bar crowded? Sort of. How many people saw the fight? I don't know. That's not an answer. Well, I didn't exactly stop to count. But this is a place you've been to before? Yes. So they know you? They know your name? Yes or no? Yes. You can't go back there. I won't. Ever. That's what I just said. I know what you're saying, but it happened. I'm sorry. Well, it can never happen again, all right? You can't draw attention to yourself like that. You have to find ways out of situations that don't risk exposing yourself. What you're learning here isn't for you to Enough! Could you just stop yourself for one second, please? No, you know what? I'm not I, trying to get I, on I your back. I won't fight anyone again, ever. Unless they're attacking me. I get it. Good. You need to get off my ass sometimes. You're not my boss every second, every day. You don't tell me who I should and shouldn't sleep with. What? If I like a guy, I'll do whatever I want. Do you understand? If you like them, fine. Why would I sleep with them if I didn't like them? What the hell was that? I don't want a big talk right now. Who are you telling her to sleep with? I am not. I was telling her not to sleep with someone, not to do it. Who? It's none of your business. <sighs> Some guy, brother of a kid from school, a congressional intern. She says she likes him, but she's gotten a little bit of information from him. Nothing, really. Well, that's just great. She sees a cute boy. She's like any other girl her age. But maybe you were right. Maybe she's not cut out for this. That wasn't... She can do it. My point was always that she shouldn't. I gotta go. Where? To work. 